Bulgaria is situated at the heart of the Balkan Peninsula. Many a European traveller has described Bulgaria as a piece of paradise. A sea, rivers, lakes, mountains, forests, plateaus and plains, warm and cool, mineral, water springs, all within the bounds of a relatively small territory. The larger portion of the country has a moderately continental climate. Some of present-day European civilization emerge in what is today Bulgaria. History refers the first records of human activity in these lands to the Paleolithic age. Hanas Beruch formed the Bulgarian state unifying old Bulgarians with the descendants of ancient Thracians and locally settled Slav tribes. Present-day Sophie is heir to an ancient Thracian city called by conquering Roman Serdica. Today Sophie is the capital of Bulgaria, the biggest and most vigorously developing city in the country. Sophie has links via roads and airways with all points, near and far removed, across the world. The Bulgarian Black Sea Littoral is a preferred holiday destination for an increasing number of tourists from around Europe. It offers an ideal package of healthy climate, numerous days of sunshine in the summer season, various resorts coming up to the mark of renowned European counterparts to make a holiday unforgettable. Palaces and churches, ruins of ancient fortresses, past and present merge on this land where life has prospered since time immemorial. Kaliakra, Mesambria, present-day Neseba and Apollonia, present-day Sosopol are most telling examples in point. Many of the conservation areas along the Bulgarian Black Sea were set up to safeguard endemic plant and animal life. Such are the reserves of Kaliakra, Kamchia, Roputamo and many others. Special care is taken, for instance, at the Kalakra Reserve to help the monk seal, an endangered species, survive and preserve the huge diversity of bird life. The town of Baltic lies some 30 kilometers to the north northeast from the port city of Varna. One of the outstanding tourist sites presently is the Royal Palace Complex, incorporating a palace with a rising tower and an expansive terrace park, alleys and paths, and stone gazebos with magnificent views of the sea. The botanical gardens are home to over 3,000 rare exotic plant species and have for many years been part of the research and training facilities of Sophie University. Like the other resorts on the Northern Black Sea, such as Constantine and Helena, Sunny Day and Riviera, Alben is geared to cater to all tastes and requirements in offering a full cream vacation. Water sports, horseback riding, tennis, golf are only but few of the past times that you can enjoy off the beach. Albania has something for everyone, like karting, bike riding, sailing and oughting under the watchful eye of highly qualified instructors. Sitting on a picturesque and ecologically clean bay on the northern Black Sea coast, the Golden Sands Resort stands only 11 kilometers away from the port city of Varna. The resort offers a full range of summer recreation and entertainment beach, volleyball, jet riding, motor boating, parachuting, extreme thrills with inflatable water attractions. In the summer heat, you can enjoy further to a cooling drink, a relaxing massage right on the beach.
Situated in the Golden Sands Nature Park, the tourist complex offers a great choice of hotel accommodation, built to European standards and offering all holiday and business comforts, conferences and seminars included. The city of Varna is situated on the Bay of Varna, some 470 kilometers to the east of the capital Sofia. Varna is Bulgaria's largest city on the Black Sea, dubbed the sea capital of the country. The Dolphinarium is a favorite attraction with visitors and children in Varna. The Cathedral Church of St. Virgin Mary is one of the city landmarks. Ubiti de Kamani, erosion chiseled rocks of 15 million years ago, is another landmark in the environs of the city. The Kamchia and Ropotamal rivers are among some of the most beautiful spots on the Bulgarian Black Sea. The resorts of Biala, Opsol, Elenite and St. Vlas added their own singular outlook and atmosphere to the overall setup. The town of Neseba lies on a small promontory and inland, some 37 kilometers to the northeast of the port of Burgas. Sunny Beach is a resort complex situated in the southern part of the Bulgarian Black Sea, 6 kilometers north of Neseba and 42 kilometers to the northeast of Burgas. For more sophisticated guests, the Southern Black Sea offers a choice of luxury hotels offering a vacation full of all kinds of thrills. Zuzopol is believed to be perhaps the earliest settlement on the Black Sea, coming into being in the 7th century BC named Apollonia. Timah houses and narrow alleys flash visitors back to long gone times. The old town offers accommodation in original Zuzopol houses. The shoreline is studded with traditional seaside restaurants and fish outlets. The Southern Black Sea is ideal for a family holiday away from the bustling resort and nighttime swinging crowds. Down south on the seashore are the Dunes Vacation Village, the resorts of Primorsko, Lozenitz and Kitting. Winding up the vacationing trail are Bulgaria's most outlying Black Sea towns of Tsarevo and Ektopol. Sinemoritz is situated at the heart of a unique conservation area, encompassing the entire ragged shoreline and the wooded peaks of the Strangia Mountain. Entertainment on the Black Sea runs round the clock. One of the most attractive propositions is a visit to an aqua park or other leisure centers in all Black Sea resorts. Many Bulgarian and foreign holiday makers prefer to go for a swim, take their meals and enjoy entertainment at one and the same spot. Most restaurants and eating outlets offer an abundant bill of fare. Specialized ones offer national cuisine, fish and dietetic meals, Chinese, Mediterranean, Arab and Indian cuisine. You could also enroll in the tasting of local wines and specialties. Nightlife at the resort is as vigorous there's entertainment and amusement for people of all ages, from most luxurious night bars and cabarets to open-air discos on the beach to help spend your time and money to the best advantage. The Bulgarian Black Sea offers an exceptional diversity of attractive choices for a summer vacation.
Mineral water springs have been, since ancient times, one of Bulgaria's greatest assets. Balneology has always been held in high regard. Curative waters have been spread far and wide. Thermal water is a principal healing agent. Highly qualified medical staff carries out admission, follow-up and final checkups to prescribe individual skin for treatment, convalescence and prophylaxis for every spa visitor. A great variety of water and electric treatments is on offer. Visitors can have the benefit of herbal, juniper, salt and alkaline baths. Underwater needles and brush massage, infrared ray therapy, low frequency impulse therapy, microwaves, ultrasound, etc. There are special healing schemes based on the miraculous effects of the local climate and curative powers of thermal waters. Bulgaria studied with various warm and cool mineral springs. Gorna Bane, Banke, Hisase, Pereva Bane, Vershets, Narechim, Velingrad and Sendanski are some of the emblems of Bulgarian spas. They offer various alternative therapies for the treatment of numerous diseases. Pressor therapy is applied to improve blood circulation. Lymph drainage tones the body up, helps metabolism and has an anti-cellulite effect. Essential oil baths with rose petals are a genuine feast for both body and mind. The Cleopatra bath contains milk for skin invigoration. A genuine attraction, the Roman bath contains wine and has an antioxidant effect. Spa, or treatment by way of water, has come to stay as a modern-day concept in our daily routine, but should in fact reflect a way of thinking and living are striving to achieve harmony between body and mind. This can be achieved by applying a variety of treatments on offer hydrotherapy, vitalizing pools, different saunas, spa facial and body programs, cosmetics, various massage techniques and all this combined with chromo aromatherapy. Spa's underlying principle and philosophy is beauty, peace of mind, vigor and harmony. The wellness society is growing with every passing year. The wellness philosopher dictates that body and mind should be stimulated jointly by relaxing programs, thermal baths, 
regenerating and beautifying therapies. The combination of relaxing treatments and physical exercise will help save all the energy you need to overcome the stress in your daily routine. Bulgaria has a vast cultural and historical heritage. It is only but few countries worldwide that pride such a wealthy heritage, a testimony to superior spiritual culture. Ternograd, the medieval capital of Bulgaria, a most holy place and stately testimonial to the enduring strength and resilience of the nation. The earliest traces of human habitation uncovered on the Trapeza Hill are dated to the 3rd millennium BC, and the ones on the Tsarevich Hill date back to the 13th century BC. Presently, there are 12 active monasteries in the town's area and its surroundings drawing crowds of visitors. The churches are decorated with sublime murals and icons, the work of leading exponents of the local Velikoternova school of icon painting. A number of rock-hewn churches, chapels and cells, UNESCO registered and monitored heritage monuments are to be found some 20 kilometers to the south of the city of Ruse. The well-preserved rock frescoes at the Ivanov Rock churches reveal the lofty style of Orthodox painting in the 14th century. Murals display the characteristically Eastern Orthodox perception of Christ's spirit and mysticism and his precursor, John the Baptist. In the remote 14th century, the area was inhabited by Yezek caste monks and hermits. The Etera Open Air Ethnographic and Architectural Museum is the largest active ethnographic museum in the Balkans. It has enshrined at its most authentic the National Revival Period culture not only of Bulgaria, but of the entire Balkans. Domestic crafts have deepest roots running in the Bulgarian way of living, processing of textile and leather materials to be used by women to produce various items by way of sewing, knitting and weaving. Pottery, cutlery, manufacturing of various household goods or typical Bulgarian folk music instruments such as the shepherd's flute, a wooden wind instrument, are considered to be strictly male occupations. The museum possesses the only one in Bulgaria collection of water-run equipment and machinery. Some of them were built actually on the site in the late 18th century. The old flour mill and the weaving mill are instances in point. The Maguri is one of the biggest caves in Bulgaria, running to a length of 3,000 meters. 1,400 meters of which are well laid out for public viewing. 
its rock paintings, 700 in all, are its most precious asset. These happen to be the only surviving specimens of primitive cave art in the Balkans, dated to the Bronze Age of more than 3,000 years ago. The Sun Calendar is of singular value too. Archaeological excavations in the Bulgarian lands have continued to bring forth unparalleled finds. Traces of a copious Thracian culture are evident in many spots across the country, remnants of Thracian towns, necropoli and monumental tombs such as the Kazanlak Sveshtari and Gulyama Kusmatka ones have been uncovered. Gulyama Kusmatka is attributed to the great Thracian king Sept III. Excavated finds have no parallels. Among the unique items are the 2400 years old gold mask, a Roman bronze statuette of Orpheus dated to the 2nd, 1st, 2nd century AD. Perpericon is one of only three rock cities uncovered till date worldwide, believed to have been the earliest one. Archaeological exploration has revealed that life on rocky Perpericon emerged as early as the Anolithic Calcolithic Age, that is the 5th, 4th millennium BC. At the end of the era, Perpericon experienced its heyday. Eventually, the place grew into a major city of antiquity. Many authors, the Roman Svetonius among them, recorded that some most fateful prophecies had been made at Perpericon in the Rodopi Mountain. It was at Perpericon that Alexander the Great was made to realize he was going to conquer the world. It was again at Perpericon many years on that Octavian Augustus heard his son was going to set up the great Roman Empire. The Mother of Horsemen is the only early Middle Age rock relief in Europe. The relief was the first Bulgarian source where the word Bulgarians came up for the first time. Plovdiv is the cultural capital of Bulgaria. It is one of the early centers of European civilization, predating Rome and Athens, a contemporary of Troy and Mycena. The old town is home to a great number of National Revival period architecture monuments. Some of them have been the homes of families highly renowned for their business and involvement with culture well outside the boundaries of the Ottoman Empire. Uzhenci is one of the truly untouched by civilization villages from the National Revival period in Bulgaria. Uzhenci was named after Bujana, the noble woman who first settled in this place. Enuden celebrates the summer solstice. Monasteries in Bulgaria have always been centers of spiritual culture. They are numerous and each one has a rich history. Rila and Bachkova monasteries are the two leading monasteries in the country. The hermit Ivan of Rila, canonized later as a saint, formed the Rila monastery in the early 10th century. Nowadays, it is the biggest active monastery in Bulgaria. The monastery has been a center of education and learning ever since its formation. Rural and ecotourism are among the most alluring propositions for anyone keen on travel and adventure. In Bulgaria, you'll find hospitable homes that have perpetuated traditions that are most authentic. Many of them are made only of timber and stone. Each house is built so that it would get the fairest amount of sunshine and would be best protected from winds and gales. In the neighborhood of a water spring. 
Builders in Bulgaria used to be among the most respected members of the public, and the best among them, even today, are regarded as masters. Today, the majority of mountain villages, hamlets and small towns do attract great numbers of tourists, offering all modern amenities and comforts. These are usually situated in ecological areas or in immediate proximity to bioreserves, home to rare plant and animal species. If you've slept in an authentic village house, if you've had fresh, ecologically clean fruit and vegetables and picked by yourself in a village market garden, if you've had an unforgettable day in the bosom of nature, trekking along the nearest available echo trail, you must have then experienced the fascination and loveliness of rural tourism. The most fascinating part of it all is to share in the overall process of cooking your own meals. This is how you're going to taste the most magical flavor of them all, the flavor of life. You may be lucky enough to lay your hands on one of the secret recipes for making Bulgarian yogurt. You could then easily make it to yourself when you get back home. Horseback riding can be regarded as a sports leisure service, hobby tourism and sporting and recreation tourism when practiced along horseback riding routes. Rafting means shooting the rapids. In Bulgaria, rafting is highly contingent upon springtime high water. The best time to practice it is from mid-April to mid-June. Rafting is usually arranged in the turbulent waters of the Struma River in the Kresna Gorge area. The vertical marble escarpments holding in a vice the bed of the local river make the Trigrad Gorge one of the most stunning gorges in the country. The dry section of the gorge is awesome indeed. The western face looms at a height of 185 meters above the dry river bed and the eastern one is even more imposing, rising to a height of 300-350 meters. Between them, they form a giant crevice, 300 meters wide at the head of the gorge and 100 meters to the north of the gorge. This is a favorite spot of rock climbing fans. Hang gliding embodies man's eternal striving after flying. This heavenly pastime has had an increasing following. Like any other sport, hang gliding requires many skills and a great deal of experience. 
what one needs to be successful at hand gliding is good movement, coordination and locomotive awareness. You may discover that hand gliding is nothing more tricky than driving a motor car. In Bulgaria, the tourist is welcomed as a guest and can be made to feel like a friend or a traveller and explorer. Those wishing to take time away from strenuous city life can put up at a village house, make their own yoghurt, enjoy the rhythms and steps of Bulgarian folk dances and eventually take back home a length of cloth or a pottery piece they have made themselves. Mama's dances is a colourful Bulgarian tradition. The mamas carry on a special belt, bells varying in size and sound. The higher they leap, the more generous the crops are going to be. The Bulgaric rocks are a genuine miracle sculpted by nature over 200 million years. There are places in Bulgaria where you can trace the root of wine from the accounts of hospitable locals to the tasting of select wines. Bulgaria is the land of roses. The oil-bearing rose was imported in Bulgaria in the 18th century from the Middle East to find most propitious climate and soil in the Tunja River Valley, huddled between the Polka Range and the Srena Gura Mountain. Bulgarian mountain resorts offer unique conditions for winter holidaying and practicing favorite sports. Mountains of various height, acreage and relief account for half of Bulgaria's territory, the Rila, Pirin, Rodopi and Vitusha. They are all home to such world-renowned skiing resorts as Aleko, Pamparovo, Bansko and Borovit are suitable for recreation, sport and tourism pursuits in all four seasons. The Pirin mountain is the second tallest mountain in Bulgaria with a salient alpine relief. The Pirin mountain offers some of the best sporting and recreation facilities in the Balkans such as numerous ski runs, several chairlifts and rope lines, heli skiing facilities serviced by helicopters and specially constructed snowboarding park. Ski runs are accident proof and excellently kept. Around the clock emergency aid service is in place too. The town of Bansko, a favorite destination for both domestic and foreign tourists, situated in the foothills of the most beautiful and towering part of the mountain. Bansko is only 160 kilometers away from the capital, Sofia and is definitely one of the best preferred skiing resorts in Bulgaria. To the south of Bansko Shili Garnica, the biggest skiing resort in the Pirin mountain. The local ski lift can service as many as 800 persons per hour over a stretch of 606 meters, immediately below the Todorka peak at an altitude of 2,450 meters lies the high ski run in Bulgaria, offering opportunities for skiing until late May. The hospitality of Bulgarian winter resorts is a unique combination of natural sites, rich historical and cultural heritage, and latter day tourist facilities. Bansko architecture is original and authentic, true to the history of the town and the spiritual quests of its residents. Standing expositions of icons display the best specimens of the local icon painting school. stone built walls fencing impressive stone built houses of the National Revival period.
The Rudopi mountain is the most picturesque mountain in Bulgaria. Pamporovo, the pearl of Bulgaria's mountain resort, sits at the heart of the Rudopi mountain, situated in an altitude of 1,650 meters at the foot of Snezhanka Peak. It is the most popular and effectively the largest skiing resort in Bulgaria. Skiing pits in Pamporovo vary in length and degree of difficulty. Regardless whether you're a beginner or a seasoned skier, you're bound to enjoy racing downhill. Pamporovo attracts tourists with its picturesque scenery, clean air, sunny and invigorating weather. Nearby are some resort villages such as Stoikite, the ethnographic complex Shirokolaka, Momchilovci, Proglet and the town of Smolen, some of which are on UNESCO's heritage list. Really is the highest mountain in the Balkans with its Musala peak rising to 2,925 meters. Borovets is the biggest resort in the real mountain. Situated at an altitude of 1,350 meters, it is surrounded by venerable pine forests which have given it its name. It is only 73 kilometers away from the capital Sofia and is easily accessible. A favorite hunting ground of Bulgarian royals in the past, Borovets is today a high-class king resort offering a variety of entertainment. Borovets offers excellent conditions for the entire range of winter sports, downhill racing, ski jumps and biathlon. Borovets traditionally has a good snow cover from the end of December to late April. 18 ski runs with a total length of 40 kilometers. Bulgarian skiing resorts are famed for having numerous hotels, restaurants and fast food outlets. That will give you an idea of the best traditions of the Bulgarian cuisine and will be up to the mark of your personal preferences. Further to a full cream holiday, our winter resorts offer ample nightlife entertainment, nighttime skiing carnivals, being a true fiesta highlight. Club culture followers have not been forgotten. There's a place for every taste and preference. The mountains of Bulgaria and its Black Sea offer excellent condition for nearly entire spectrum of modern day preferred varieties of tourism. Come just but once to Bulgaria and you will keep coming back looking forward to yet another adventure. <laughs> <laughs> 